In this video, we are continuing with our mechanics series part 2 and in this video, we will study about sin theta. Now suppose we have been given a right angle triangle A, B, C with sides 5, 3 meter and 4 meter and this is the angle theta. Theta is the symbol for angle. Now sin theta is the ratio of perpendicular over hypotenuse. Now for this theta, which side will be perpendicular? Because we are having two perpendiculars here. For this angle, the perpendicular will be the side which is just opposed, opposite to what? Theta which is what 4 and hypotenuse is the longest sign. So this is what sin theta is. It is the it is simply the ratio of what perpendicular to hypotenuse. Now suppose we are not having perpendicular and hypotenuse then how can we calculate the value of sin theta for a given angle. So in that you have to memorize one table. For example had this angle been 30 degree say it is 30 degree. So you have to cram this value. We are not having proof of this at this level but we are learning the value. Sin 30 will be half which means the ratio of perpendicular to the hypotenuse will be what half okay class so similarly we are having values for different angle also i'm writing all the values 5 6 value you have to remember sin 0 degrees 0 sin 30 i've just written is what 1 by 2 sin 45 is 1 by root 2 sin 60 is root 3 by 2 and sin 90 is 1 so these are the values which we need to keep in mind uh, when we are doing Questions on numericals related to pulley, related to mechanics, and when we are dealing with what? Sin theta and cos theta. In the previous video, I have given you the values of cos theta. In this video, we have covered what? Sin theta. Then the coming chapter, in the coming videos will continue resolution of vector class. Thanks for watching.